What's up, everyone, and welcome back to Movie Rays. Elite Season 3 is already on Netflix with tons of twists that made fans craving for more. Well, we're in luck since the fourth season has been officially confirmed, and according to all reports, it will bring even more shocking storylines. Keep watching to find out everything there is about the fourth season of Netflix's Elite. New Photos Aside from the really exciting teaser that Netflix released for Elite Season 4, Netflix also shared some photos where we can see all the new cast members and, of course, some of the old cast that will stick with the show for another season. So what sort of drama should we expect? Keep watching to find out. Lo siento, pero no. No puedo. Lo siento, mama. Release date. Similar to the concept of Game of Thrones, Elite is a show where you should expect not to see your favorite character in the next season, as there's a lot of, um, killing. As we all know, a lot of characters we know won't make an appearance in Season 4 because of all the events in Season 3. The big murder mystery as to who killed Polo at the party is obviously going to be the focus in Season 4, but since the most dedicated fans can't wait to find out, they've already started to speculate and guess who did it. Netflix already released the first official teaser for Elite Season 4, and things are getting a little bit messy between the new students of Los Encinas and all the characters that we already know. The great news is that along with the teaser, Netflix also released an official release date for the show's new season. The show will be coming back on June 18th. Have you guys seen the teaser? Did you come up with some theory on what we should expect in Season 4 of Elite? Let us know. Elite Season 4 Cast You certainly remember that after Polo's death, Lou and Nadia, Mina El Hamani, left Spain in order to study at Columbia University in New York City. Carla, portrayed by Esther Exposito, also left the country. Nevertheless, she did split the duties of her wineries between her father and Valerio, Jorge Lopez. At the end of Season 3, the show jumped two months into the future and we saw several friends returning to Los Encinas to finish their final year. According to the teaser and all events that occurred in Season 3, Season 4 will include Miguel Bernardo as Guzman, Aaron Piper as Ander, Itzen Escamilla as Samuel, Omar Ayuso as Omar, Claudia Salas as Rebecca, Georgina Amoros as Cayetana. One of the several new cast members that are going to make an appearance in the show are Mano Rios, Carla Diaz, Martina Cariri, and Paul Granch. Most of them will play the children of the new director of Los Encinas, who will be represented by the actor Diego Martin. Now that we know all the faces we're going to see in the fourth very anticipated season of Elite, let's get into the more interesting part, which is the plot. More interesting storylines. As we saw in the previous three seasons, the class conflicts played a key storyline in the show, so we should expect the same thing in the next season. Since Los Encinas is growing its privilege, we should expect much more drama. Paul Granch will be one of the new faces in the show, as we previously said, but his character is still anonymous. What we know, though, is that he will be caught in the middle of some drama that will be featured. Everything else about his involvement is still a secret. What we also know is that the tension between the students is stronger than ever, so maybe we should expect the unexpected? It was also revealed that this will be the last season for actors Itzen Escamilla and Omar Ayuso. With their characters Samuel and Omar, the two have been a part of the show ever since the pilot episode. In season 3, Samuel found out that his mother and brother could come back to Spain after leaving for Morocco. However, we don't know if they did come back. And when it comes to Omar, he changed his mind and didn't go to New York with his sister, Nadia. At the very end of season 3, Omar met Ander and Samuel as a student at Los Encinas. We can't believe how great the plot was in Season 3. Because of this, Season 4 does live on high expectations. Hola. ¿Habéis visto a Samuel? Yo. Season 3 Impact on Season 4 As we previously stated, Season 3 of The Elite ended up with Lou, Dana Paola, and Nadia, Mina Helmani. Receiving a scholarship and leaving their Los Encinas friends to study at Columbia University in New York City. After Polo's death, this seemed like the best decision they could go with. Carla, Esther Exposito, also gave her goodbye and left to study in a private boarding school. Since she left her wineries to her father and Valerio, Jorge Lopez, we won't see her in the next season. In an interview with Oprah Magazine, the actress Esther Exposito said, It's very emotional and the characters go through difficult situations and times, but there's a lot of love and not only between girlfriends and boyfriends, but also between friends. 
Well, we're surely sad about her departure, but fortunately, we know characters like Omar, Omar Ayuso, and Rebecca, Claudia Salas, will come back to reprise their roles in Season 4. And of course, we can't wait to see the new faces of Manu Rios, Carla Diaz, Martina Caridi, and Paul Grinch, and what they will be involved in. New York City as we all know, Lou and Nadia moved to New York City, and if you're as obsessed with the show as we are, you can't help but wonder if the show will follow them in New York. As Elite Daily stated, the show's brand new face, Malik, late to Sene, will join Lou and Nadia. Will anyone else join them? Also, we all know that Guzman would want to be with Nadia, so let us know what you think about that. <laughs> Vendetta. Season 3 also showed the Cayetana, Jorgina Amoros, didn't get what she wanted. To be more precise, she didn't get the job she always dreamed of. So naturally, we can't help but question ourselves, what will Cayetana's life be as a janitor? Since this is elite, one thing looks certain, she will try to get revenge on those she finds guilty for the events she went through. Because of Season 4's time jump, we should expect some major changes in the plot. Also, the tension between the characters and their secrets revealing attitude would make this season one of the best ones yet. Also, since a fifth season was confirmed by Netflix, we should not expect the characters to forgive each other and move on. Nevertheless, because of the announcement of Formula TV that season four will be the last one to feature Itzan Escamilla and Omar Ayuso, fans are already coming up with different theories about their departure. Why do you guys think that they'll be left out from the show? Let us know. New twists. Most people are doubtful when it comes to giving Elite a try, and because of all that drama that the show features, you should know that once you start watching the show, you won't stop until you binge watch it. Ever since the first season, the show gives a dark tone of mystery and keeps you entertained. Also, one of the best features is that the show's focus goes on every character. With every new episode, you notice a development in all of the characters as the show explores them all deeply. If you're a fan of mysteries, this is the perfect show for you as you'll be left with tons of questions after every episode. And just when you think you've got it all figured out, boom, a shocking twist comes and you're questioning everything all over again. When it comes to the fifth season of Elite, the season was renewed in January 2020 along with the fourth season. The filming of season five started in February 2021 and on February 25th, 2021. Okay. <sighs> I have feelings, bitch. So guys, what do you expect from Elite Season 4? Let us know in the comment section below. If you enjoyed our video, make sure you subscribe to our channel so you never miss any of our videos in the future. As always, thanks for watching.